Ultralight helicopters resemble normal helicopters in appearance, but they are built lighter and with a much simpler structure. They can be sold as ready-to-fly or kit versions with an option to buy the engine separately, depending on the manufacturer. They may not be able to fly as high or as quickly as a regular helicopter, and they have a very limited range and load capacity, but ultralight helicopters can be an excellent choice especially for hobbyists because they are less expensive, can land in tight spaces, and can be transported on a trailer, if necessary. They can also provide a fantastic opportunity for aviation enthusiasts to fly a helicopter for a comparatively affordable price. In this video, I'm sharing my top list of some of the best ultralight helicopters you can still buy today, including their estimated price and specs. This is the first video of a series that I'm doing on helicopters and other rotorcraft from different weight classes and price points. Hold on to your seats and check out the most expensive helicopter at the end of my list. This is Aviation Federation, sharing with you exciting information about the latest and greatest in aviation and beyond. Starting at number 3 is the Mosquito XET. Previously owned by Mosquito Aviation, this helicopter was originally produced by Innovator Technologies in Canada, but as of 2019, production was resumed by Composite FX in Florida. To manage the 71 kW or 95 horsepower solar turbine, the XET uses custom gearboxes. It is also equipped with an MZ202 60CV engine that's around 300 pounds, making the total gross weight of the aircraft just a little over 600 pounds. This model has a cruise speed of 70 knots or approximately 80 miles per hour and a fuel tank that will allow you to stay airborne between 2 to 4 hours. The latest version of this helicopter remains as a one-seater and has a cockpit fairing but with a more advanced exhaust system, as well as a 40 cm larger rotor diameter to support the increased gross weight. The base price of this ultralight is $32,000 US dollars. Hovering at number 2 is the Eagle Helicycle. This is a small single-seat kit-built helicopter, powered by a modified 150 horsepower T6232 turbine engine. It is manufactured by Helicycle Ventures in New Mexico, and is a reasonably priced helicopter with great reliability and performance. Among its features are a completely harmonized rotor system, elastomeric thrust bearings, a modulated collective pitch mechanism, and electronic throttle control. The helicycle's controls are actually modeled after the Robinson R-22 helicopter, so quick stops and auto-rotations are performed similarly in both aircraft, enabling new pilots to adapt to flying their kits with minimal changes. It has an empty weight of 500 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 850 pounds. Its maximum cruise speed is pegged at 96 knots or just around 110 miles per hour. This ultralight helicopter has a current starting price of US$40,000. <music> Flying high at number one is the Hungerocopter. This helicopter is manufactured by Hungary-based Hungaro Copter Limited and is intended as a kit for amateur construction. This was designed to comply with European Microlight aircraft regulations and has a 7-meter diameter two-bladed rotor. This ultralight features a single main rotor and tail rotor, options for a single-seat enclosed cockpit with a fairing or an open cockpit without a windshield, a skid landing gear, and a Subaru EJ22 or EJ25 automotive conversion engine with 135 or 160 horsepower. 
The aircraft's gross weight is around 950 pounds with the empty weight at just over 660 pounds. And it can achieve a cruise speed of 70 knots, or about 81 miles per hour. The time required to build the full kit is estimated to be around 300 hours. A fully decked out kit can cost as high as 90,000 US dollars. Do you agree with my list of ultralight and kit helicopters at this price range? Do you have a preferred maker that deserves to be on this list? If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up or leave a comment down below. Keep your eyes peeled for the next video in this series and check out my other videos for more interesting aviation goodness. Thank you for watching and fly safe.